After multiple deadly wrecks over the weekend, some drivers are concerned about the lack of guardrails on one of the busiest roads in Jefferson County. Our WVTM 13's Aaron Llewellyn was at that area earlier this evening, finding out if there's any plans to make the roads safer. This is like the second time in the past two years that a car has gone off this cliff. I mean, fortunately, this wasn't a fatality like the, the first one. Concerns from people in the Bluff Park area over this busy intersection at Valley Road and West Oxmoor Road after a car went over the cliff on Friday. There's nothing there to tell you, hey, stop. You know, there's no reflectors. There's no nothing over there. If you look at it, it's just grass. In this video from a nearby business, you can see a woman stop at the fork in the road before falling 15 feet. She was taken to the hospital with a head injury. WVTM 13 was there and saw crews pull the car from the cliff. There's supposed to be a guardrail here. I just want to know why there's not one. Steve Russell says neighbors asked city leaders to put a guardrail up after two teenagers died in 2019 when they drove off the cliff. There were some questions about it and they said that, you know, they were going to look into putting a guardrail here. And but nothing's changed. The street is still open and Russell says people's lives are at risk. There's supposed to be a guardrail here. I just want to know why there's not one. And that was Aaron Llewellyn reporting. WVTM 13 did reach out to City Council President Wardeen Alexander, who represents that area. We have not heard back at this time.